another video. Welcome back to more WWE 2K17. And I'm sorry that I haven't been posting a lot of videos this often, but I've been just busy. You know how it is, so. Let's go to WrestleMania in the day. And then, yeah, this looks good. So it's the Bloodline versus Tyson Kidd and Cesaro and Nelly. Coming up next is a huge six-man tag team match. It's the Usos against Team Tyson Kidd. This could blow the roof off this place. Yeah, Roman Reigns has cousins. The Usos are Roman Reigns' cousins as well as The Rock. in a clever California. <laughs> This capacity crowd is on their feet in support of this six-man tag match. Yeah, let's don't make them wait any longer. Let's get it started. Judging from the reaction of this Santa Clara crowd, I think we know who the favorite is for this one. The bloodline are in the ring. And here comes Tyson and Kidd. And Cesaro. 436 pounds, Tyson Kidd and Cesaro. You know, sometimes Cesaro the and Tyson Kidd. In his eye. And this is one of those times. At the risk of patting myself. six-man tag match. Once you are eliminated, you head back to the locker room. So it will be Tyson Kidd well, and it's Roman Reigns starting off the match. Leaves the winner. Oh, this is going to be good. Two teams, six competitors, and one big bunch of excitement. Three versus three. Here we go. And one last thing, these so-called laid-back fans in Santa Clara are anything but. They're fired up here tonight. He hits the drop kick from an incredible vertical leap. Let's talk about Tyson Kidd for a moment. He needs to be prepared for the fact that there will be action all around him. But is that something you can really prepare for? When you have two quality partners by your side, you have a tendency to walk with a little bit of a swagger. I think that's what we're seeing here. Now this is a moment. Right now we have six of arguably the greatest WWE competitors in that ring. He's certainly showing us something new from his repertoire. That's cool. I like new stuff. Now, why did he do that? 
A move like that's your low. It's appalling, if you ask me. Totally disrespectful. Well, when he sees a belt, he likes to hit below it. He's coming Tyson in. Kid, speed, agility, and Jimmy Uso. Certainly makes him one of the most versatile superstars in WWE. And Cesaro and is coming in. He's as comfortable flying off the top rope as he is grinding an opponent's face down into the mat. I'm where's that? Looking to build momentum. Double under it. That's a first. What a move. Definitely sets a tone for the evening. I like it. God, what a stiff shot. And right on the mark. And Cesaro spills out to the ringside. Back in the ring again. And Cesaro with the reversal. Jimmy Uso starting to sweat here. He's going to need to find a way to fire back. Come on. If he can't withstand this, he's in the wrong profession. Oh, it's been a great match up to this point, and this could really go either way. You know, there are a truckload of fundamentals that Tyson learned in the Hart Dungeon and under the tutelage of Owen and Bret Hart, but Tyson has taken those teachings and brought his abilities to a whole other level. Now it's Roman Reigns on his heels. To be expected when you combine six of WWE's most volatile forces into one match. Bugger, we're going to see what this guy is made of. Well said, John. And now's the time for one of these guys to take hold of this match. He wants no part of the outside. And I don't blame him. Nothing good ever happens outside the ring. For the blockbuster couldn't connect. Oh, big elbow. Let's do it. And Neville gets tagged in. For Reigns. And the cover for the win. Not going to win many matches with that move. What a shot. Roman Reigns, he may be done for. No kidding. Roman Reigns might be out cold after that one.
Looking for it. He's got him in position. He's looking for the catch. Neutralizer. Got it. Catch. Neutralizer. This could be it. I think he's got it. One. Two. That's three. And Roman Reigns is gone from the bloodline. Breaks it up. He drops the elbow. He's sitting there. Looking for it. Ah, Tyson Kidd. Look at him right away. What a collision! He 
He's having a seriously hard time getting back to his feet after that. What was Jimmy Uso's best strategy at this point? It appears his opponent has his number right now. Well, these guys have been so tightly matched up until now, but this might be where the finally starts to change. I don't know. There doesn't seem to be a clear-cut winner yet in this one. Somehow, he's kicked it into another gear here tonight. And he's heading back in. I can't blame him. You don't want to get caught outside the ring for too long. He's in some serious pain here. Uh, 2K22 It's coming out in March But the full game is not fully out There's only front cover and back cover And um, there's like different types of stuff But, but it, it's not fully out yet
WWE fans watching this match all around the world. We want to say hi to them all over the countries, even Manila, where I use their emblem. Uh oh, really pushing his opponent to the limit here. And that's the way he has to be if he wants to win here tonight. Oh, and DDT, that could be it. Heads up. You can practically see the pick. There's the pan. Ken is a point kick out. Two, three. And the pick ball gets him the win. And your winners. Cesaro, Tyson Kidd, and Neville. Here are your winners, Tyson Kidd, Cesaro, and Neville. Now that's earning a well-fought victory. At the risk of getting ahead of myself, if this guy keeps winning matches like that, we better reserve some room for him in the Hall of Fame. That's one of those personal WrestleMania moments and memories that will last a lifetime. I'm so glad we all got to be a part of it. And I will see you guys next time. I'll see you guys next time. Peace.